So Naka and Dominic have finally welcomed their baby and I can just imagine their joy. They had gone through so many struggles to get pregnant from supplements to seeing different doctors to being told you would never be able to conceive and after even conceiving Naka got to have a reaction to the pregnancy. Many people dragged her online saying she's gonna be having twins. There is no way you can be that big at 26 weeks. Even just before her pregnancy seems to be growing very fast. But she came and explained to say if it's because her body doesn't like it. It treats pregnancy like an allergy. So she's just bulging out. Anyway, praise God. They have welcomed their baby. And the baby's name is Giovanni. Uh, which means God is gracious. So here is how their labor vlog went. It started around 1 a.m. And she was having trouble and everything and girl was going through it and wondering why people just get to do it again like if they have to go through this pain why do they have to do it again this is the mystery and we just leave it up to the guide about that right and she was going through it and Dominic here tried to you know tell her to breathe in and breathe out and she was like just cut it out okay let me just be there and do my own thing so she had planned to have a, a, a home birth okay so she tried the first day and here she's just going through it she was saying i'm really struggling to breathe and from time to time she would fall into sleep because she was just so exhausted maybe for like three minutes and um, two minutes and just be out of it because of the contractions it was it ended up into the following morning of course dominic did not leave her he kept on encouraging her and etc and they were still going you know going strong for their contractions and apparently she had dilated up to seven centimeters and they were just getting excited about it it was good and everything and it seemed that in the afternoon naka was doing better like the contractions were not much but then it ended into day two and this is 7 p.m and it's just not looking good so it seems it was just taking long and at this point it had to move to plan b they wrote at this point things weren't going as planned and we were preparing to move forward with our plan b even though naka and our baby were healthy we didn't have to want to wait longer and take a risk where it could be too late the health of naka and our baby is always priority so they took their bags and they were just off to the hospital mama was walking by herself you know she was getting some downtime and etc at the hospital she said she was good and they ended up deciding to just get a c-section because it's like her dilation was going backwards this is the first time i'm hearing this like the day before she was seven then she dropped to a five and then she dropped to a three and at this point she was just tired and out of it and she reached they reached this decision and they were okay with it as you can see she's giving that good to go kind of sign like I just want this baby out at this point. Maybe in my mind, I'm thinking maybe her cervix got um, swollen or something. Anyway, here Naka, I mean Dominic is just around and he's seeing through um, the whole process and she's smiling on. And finally, she had a baby cry. She got emotional and the baby was birth to her for skin to skin. And they're just like, having a little moment. You can see their baby is just by Naka's side. It's definitely a... A relief after a long time I just feel everybody felt like these people are pregnant forever because they had a pregnancy journey that wasn't the easiest I'm gonna share about that so anyway we watch the new chapter in our life begins and yeah definitely and she Naka and Dominic appreciated how they did their c-section like it's so unreal and it's just so neatly done otherwise congratulations to Naka and Dominic I definitely wouldn't have loved her to go under the knife and you know things happen and mama is good tell me what you guys think in the comment section would you have preferred she had a normal birth a home birth or just to be at the hospital get the c-section and etc with all of this otherwise here's for now but i have more to share with you guys so i'll see you in the next video remember to subscribe to this channel